today we get to compete in the national championship game and I'm pretty anxious right now. I'm just ready for the game. i excited to go play <laughs> my last game and hopefully, um, you know, I just, I just want to play my hardest and not leave this experience um, wishing I had done something different. Coach Gomez is just telling us we need to go 1-0 today. It's just like any other game, any other moment we step out on the floor, we make the most of it. And so we're just trying to pull out the, the end of this season and just go out undefeated. Now that we've made it to this point, it's just like, go 1-0 today. That's all we've got to do. Walking into Banker's Life Field, it was like, whoa, this arena is for us to play the national championship game in. It's crazy. It's huge. Um, it's everything you want to play in a national championship game. You know, all the lights, the colors, the floors redone. And just, um, I walked in thinking, I get to play my last college basketball game in this arena. What, what more could you ask for? Um, for this being my last game, I couldn't have asked for anything better, honestly. You know, you get to finish off your entire career with a national championship game, and that's what every little girl dreams of whenever she's little, so it's just awesome. Just those butterflies in your stomach before that jump ball goes off, and oh, I just, it's just an indescribable feeling almost. I mean, it's just a moment that you never want to end. So going into this championship game, it's going to be my last one which is kind of a bittersweet deal. Um, there's no better way to end your career, but also on the sad part, you know, it is my last time to put on a uniform and get to compete with the team. But I'm just very thankful it's with this team and that I get to play one more game under Coach Gomez. All right, go out and have that fun, that ferocity, that focus. Play out of love, play out of love. An intense feeling for each other, for the game, all right? For the one who brought you to this point, just play out a good, have a good heart, a good-hearted, open-minded, have a fun time. You know what I'm saying? You guys have done a lot to get here, so let's go out and play. They're gonna sell themselves on. They're just gonna play harder than you. We're, that's not gonna happen. You're just gonna play so hard. Go to exhaustion. Go to exhaustion. Okay. Toughness. One, two, three. Toughness. back the other way on the right hand side with the basketball is Kiana Engel and it's intercepted Hopple a race to the goal Hopple lays it up and that one's in we have points folks right side Anchorage shot put up it's flat and a rebound taken by Fowler as we're tied 2-2 Hopple's gonna put up another three and that one's good Engel up top pass to the left block backing her way in strong shot blocked by Schneider, that's her 200th career block as Devine had her shot blocked the other way. Fowler up and in, and one. Fowler with the basketball. Pivoting, gives it to Hampton. Hampton spots for three, it's good! Hampton, the double-double with the three. Hampton inside the Schneider. Schneider kicks it out, Brophy for three. That's good, a first three by Brophy. Five minutes remaining, and LCU is up by 12 with their largest lead of the game. Three-pointer forced up, and that one's good. Here come the Seawolves, a three-pointer by Angle. 90 seconds ago, seven-point game. Kick back out, three on the way, and banked off the glass and in by Dent. Her first point of the game. It's a four-point game, 110 to go. Hampton, the runner, it's good! Hampton's got 19. Five seconds to go. The shot is up and it is good with 4.1. It's a five point game. Zabo will get it to Schneider, to Hampton. And the school that's not allowed to dance has won the dance. The Lady Sheps are the national champions.